students in the last class we have seen some problems on magma minima word problems today we will <coughs> solve some more questions on uh, magma minima word problems because they will be asked for six months see the question a very important question and this can be asked two three time uh, two three models first let us see what is the question so that the volume of the largest cone that can be inscribed in a sphere of radius capital r is 8 by 27 volume of the sphere that means a sphere is given we have to find out the cone with the maximum volume what is the volume of the cone such that it has maximum and also so that the volume of the cone is 8 by 27 of the volume of the sphere assume that o is the center of the sphere this is radius of the sphere radius of the sphere radius of the sphere let these points be a b c so first thing what is given is given radius of the sphere is capital r whatever the units may be next let us assume small r be the radius of the cone radius of the cone and let this point be x let this point be some d so let o d is equal to x okay so from this right triangle you can say capital r square is equal to small x square plus small r square also small x square is equal to capital r square minus small r square so here i have taken the variable as x among all the cones which can be inscribed in a sphere you have to find the volume whose volume is maximum and you have to show that that volume is 8 by 27 of the volume of the sphere now from this right triangle we have capital r square is equal to x square plus r square r square is equal to capital r square minus x square that means among all the cones we need uh, the cone whose volume is maximum and that can be inscribed in this sphere now let radius of the cone is equal to small r height is equal to h that height see the figure you can find height of the cone is equal to capital r plus x capital r is the radius of the sphere a o and this length o d we have assumed as x therefore here h of the height of the cone is equal to capital r plus x so these two measurements i will be using here to find volume of the cone therefore volume of the cone v is equal to the formula is 1 by 3 pi r square h this can be written as v is equal to pi by 3 r square can be written as capital r square minus x square and height h can be written as capital r plus x that means we have written volume in terms of the variable x you may get one doubt sir there is one more uh, no, observation uh, variable that is r but here r is not the variable why what is r r is the volume of the sphere already it is given fixed so therefore it will work as a constant the variable is only x now we will be differentiating with respect to x therefore v dash is equal to pi by 3 we will apply even to v formula first function derivative of second function is 1 plus second function derivative of first function is minus 2x because r square derivative is 0 and minus x square derivative is minus 2x if you simplify that is equal to pi by 3 take r plus x as common here we have r minus x and minus 2x further if you simplify it is pi by 3 r plus x into r minus 3x so we have written v dash in terms of factors so that we can find critical points very easily now for maxima minima for maxima or minima we make v dash is equal to 0 in the last class also we were discussing we have to maximize or minimize v that means first v v dash v dash is equal to 0 by equating v dash is equal to 0 we will get critical points we find second derivative v double dash and we verify v double dash at that point according to positive negative we decide it is maxima or minima so equate v dash is equal to 0 that is pi by 3 r plus x into r minus 3 x is equal to 0 therefore x is equal to minus r not possible that means rejected that means radius cannot be negative of the sphere second one is r minus 3 x is equal to 0 therefore x is equal to capital r by 3 
So, this may be one critical point that we have to check at this point the volume of the cone is maximum or minimum. Now, let us check V double dash. So, here V dash we have pi by 3 r plus x into r minus 3 x. V double dash is equal to pi by 3 first function r plus x derivative of second function is minus 3 plus second function r minus 3 x into derivative of first function into 1. We do not need further simplification also just we have to substitute. Now, let us see what is V double dash at the critical point capital R by 3 that is equal to it is very simply this will become 0 and it is negative. If you substitute x is equal to r by 3 this is positive into negative therefore, overall become negative therefore, at x is equal to capital R by 3 V is maximum that means well volume of the cone is maximum. So, if x is equal to capital R by 3 let us find separately what is the volume of the cone and volume of the sphere sometimes find volume of the largest cone that can be inscribed in a sphere will be asked therefore, let us solve both questions. What is the volume of the cone now? Volume of the cone is equal to 1 by 3 pi r square h or we have simplified form also here we have that is pi by 3 capital R square minus x square means r square by 9 into capital R plus r by 3. If we simplify pi by 3 this is 8 r square by 9 this is 4 r by 3 that is equal to if you multiply and simplify all the things 32 pi r cube 